Chris from Mulberry Grove Family Farm. We're going to install a Delmhorst FX2000 uh, hay sensor in a John Deere 567 baler. You'll get a the 1986 sensor. The recommended location for the 1986 sensor requires that the bolts and the insulators pass from the inside of the baler through the tube frame to the outside of the baler. The kit that ships does not reach in a 567 baler. Therefore, you'll need to purchase an extension kit and one 2-inch number 10 stainless steel machine screw. This is what the sensor looks like with the extension kit. The first thing that we do is drill the half-inch holes. We're, here we're using an electromagnetic drill press to drill the holes. These holes go from the inside of the baler through the tube frame out the other side. Once these holes are completed, we switch over to a hand drill. The top hole is not drilled completely out the other side of the tube frame. The bottom hole is drilled from the inside all the way through to the outside of the tube frame. Next, the insulators are inserted from the outside of the baler through to the inside. Note that the insulators are actually too long. Here we're using a hacksaw blade to trim back the insulator so that it's flush with the inside of the baler. Next, we slide the sensor into place. Then we attach the wires and tighten all the nuts and the bolts. Note the upper hole where the number 10 machine screw is placed. This completes the baler portion for connecting your Delmhorst FX2000 to your John Deere baler.